congratulations <laughs> uh, to you, Rafael. And I know it's important to you, and it means a lot for you to be representing Azerbaijan. Uh, if you want to just speak about that for a second, but congratulations. Uh, hey, thank you. I'm really, I'm really happy to sit here. And uh, yes, I'm really happy to represent Azerbaijan and start like this, you know. This is my, this is my roots, my, my family, my history. This is land of my history, and I want to say yes, I'm in Azerbaijan. And I want to say thank you all my, to all my Azerbaijan and Kyrgyzstan also who support me. Nice. Well, congratulations. First question is a simple one. Uh, how do you feel about your performance in there tonight? I feel great. I feel great. I don't know how to explain this. How to explain this, like in English. I don't know how to explain this in Russian, but in, <laughs> in English, like so, so also. So feel tell me, uh, I got to ask about this wrestling because listen, I, I've, I've trained with a lot of guys who part-time in wrestling who's more, mostly known for other uh, skills, like right? stand-up and whatnot. But your wrestling isn't fly-by-night. You have an ability to really keep the fight where you're going. Are we going to see some, like, accolades come from your history? Like, are you, you know, are, are you really a, a really, you know, professional when it comes to this wrestling? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know. My, my wrestling uh, look good? Good. It looked really yes. good. He really good. One time, I, he take me down, but... Yeah, there's no problem. He broke my record, nine, 95 and 5. Mm -hmm. What now? <laughs> no, I'm not number two anymore. Yeah, <laughs> but this is what it is. Yeah, I'm not just Muay Thai fighter. I'm, I'm start fighting MMA like long, long, long time ago. Mm -hmm. This is, I'm not no, only Muay Thai when I beginning. Yeah, that's why my wrestling, I, when, I, when I was young, 14 and 15 years old, I also train wrestling. I go into uh, to wrestling class. Okay. Like when I'm 14 years old. That's, there you go. That's why I have a little bit of skills. Mm, okay. Faziz, uh, I know at the end of fights you like to have a fun call out. You know, mm -hmm. you call out Nadal. You don't usually yeah. name a fighter. But if I give you two fighters' names, I'm thinking Matias Gamrot, a number eight, or Benil Darius, number six. Do either of those guys intrigue you for a fight, uh, Gamrot or Darius? I don't know, man. I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's lo it's looking good. It's looking good if we fight with uh, Darius or Matios. It's it's looking good. It's, it's looking really good you know, now, because I'm now what I, I'm going to number seven maybe, and yeah. then Matios is number eight and fight number seven and number and then number eight. That's good. But I think uh, like I don't know who I am. I'm I'm nothing in this sport. But I think that's good for mix now. Something top five with uh, like if I fight with someone is from top five. And Matios fight with someone from top five. We need to mix it because top five is long time stay, stay in top five, same people, same You're faces, right. you know. Yeah. And we need we need to like make some mix, you know. I, I, some I new blood. Know. Yes, new, new blood. blood. Yeah. New broken noses. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Hey, going five rounds is not an easy thing, and you did that for the first time. But going five rounds in train is not the same. So, what is your takeaways from tonight? Oh, five rounds. I hate it. <laughs> Today, when, when I finish round, now, now round two or round three, I think, what is that? I have two more rounds. <laughs> I won't cry in, in, in the corner, but but my, my, my friend, Syed, he started to talk with me like a, like with his dog, you know, and uh, and I feel like, oh, I, I need to go and, and take this go and, take, and then make a blot again, you know. Yeah. It's a big, it's a big win, and I, I am curious what that means to you. Rafael dos Anjos, not only just a former champion, but somebody who is probably going to be in the Hall of Fame. I mean, he's done incredible things. So, does it mean more to you to beat somebody like Rafael dos Anjos? Of course, I like challenges. Rafael dos Anjos is a big challenge for me, and uh, today I make a good step with broken nose, with broken face. My face is like I'm lost today, but <laughs> this is what it is. Yes, I, I I'm looking at one more challenge. I like I like a challenge uh, because I like to make a test for my skills. Mm -hmm. Today I make one more test, and I wanna I wanna make more tests. Mm -hmm. Well, you passed the test with flying colors. You're getting fifty thousand extra dollars for hey, that tonight as well. Man. Picking up a performance bonus. So congratulations thank to you, so you Raphael, and thank you so much for joining us at the desk. And congratulations, I'm sure uh, everybody in Azerbaijan is very excited. Thank you so, so much. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.